As a lot of Android 12 L or Android 12.1 based customers are out for many devices. For example, for Mi Tool device, we have a dub fest OS based on Android 12 L, one of the best rooms ever I've used, talking about based on Android 12.1. Android 12.1 based dub fest OS is actually quite smooth, super smooth, buttery smooth, and it has a very good kind of UI, good features, and a lot more things. Moving to default things first of all, we have the default launcher called Dub Launcher which of course has a better options if you compare it with the pixel launcher and of course the launcher is not compatible with this one yet so yes it was a very good choice actually and we have the quick settings panel in a white background looks quite good by the way if you're a fan of these white backgrounds instead of the black one you might love this thing and also if you're able to see we have a blur available which unfortunately you don't get in all the custom rooms so far but in dove as we have the blur available and the blur looks definitely cool i think so in my opinion this might be a very good choice for you this is what we have called dove as screen recording option is also there if you move on to the other options for example if you move the default launcher settings or features which you have by default we have the icons related customizations available for you for example we also have uh, some customization related to interface search bar use themed icons for the search bar and google search bar themed we have some app drawer customizations available we have uh, some miscellaneous which means we can hide the apps in the app launcher is app drawer this is a good thing by the way the app locker is already available but now we have the hide apps feature also there the app launcher of course very good choice which you have by default available moving on to some other things which are included in this version or this custom room in home screen or icons we have same kind of options available in the default launcher which seems very good you also have the MIUI camera pre-installed which is actually a very very good thing a positive thing for a lot of users if you need a MIUI camera a need a custom room which includes MIUI camera by default then the first OS is here which includes a MIUI camera so yes this might also be a very good choice for you and also you can install other camera modes graphene os gcam modes and whichever you want to try it out you can if you move on to the safety net status which matters a lot of course safety net status in my case of course passing without having any issues as just mentioned this this is one of the best custom rooms i've ever tried i'm talking about the previous versions also i'm talking about this version also because this version is always great and this is what we have safety net status is passing without rooting your device if you want to root you can use you can root advice with the latest badges question and you can also hide the badges and safety net status will still be passed for you so yes this also might be a positive thing about this one if you move on to the settings then let's take a look at the ui which you have by default display etc or any kind of features almost kind of same no major changes available here no major differences if you could check it out with if you compare it with other custom homes what we have window level blurs if this, this option is enabled then you will see blur everywhere and unfortunately this option is not available for all the custom homes so the first OS is here which includes this feature and of course working both perfectly fine wallpapers and style also does not include the wallpaper colors option so keep this thing in your mind because other than else things are basically same security section face lock fingerprint app lock as expectedly also available and auto reboot option is also there so yes this also might be a very good choice for you other than else things are basically same there are no major changes or nothing else about this one this room is actually quite interesting and quite 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 good for you to use it on your device as your daily driver depends upon which device you're using but for mutual device users i think so it's a good choice if we move to customization section we have the monet engine customizations fonts icon packs and all the basic things all the customization based things which you have in all the custom rooms everything is already there unlimited google photo storage is also there as an option so yes if you don't need it you can simply disable that option miscellaneous also has the volti icons customizations logo customizations which means overall a very good choice for you i think so you definitely need to try it out these are things i just want to let you know if you want to install this thing on advice make sure to install the link is already available in the description install from custom recovery and you are good to go these were things i just want to let you know i hope you like this video if you like this don't forget to like and share this and as always i will see you in the next video until then goodbye over the edge feel like i'm floating through